Hey guys, this is Jason. Welcome back to my class. All right, in today's section, I will show you how to make a quick rendering. So let's get back to in our design tool. Find image and video, click it, and we will enter the page of rendering. Okay, so let me make a brief introduction for this page. On the top, you can see we have different types of rendering for the panorama, the perspective view, and also for the top view. So you can press number three to see the difference. For top view, we can see the whole floor plan for the models and the interior design, okay? And also we have video and also for video templates. So I will introduce this page in the perspective view, okay? So on our left side, you can see in the panel, we have different aspect of radius. So we have 16 to 9, so that's the normal radius. And also 9 to 16, that's for the mobile internal. And also, if you want to make some focal length, you can choose 1 to 1 or 3 to 4. So that's the difference. And also, you can choose different resolution like 1K, 2K, and 4K. So if you want to render some demo, I prefer you can choose with 1K or 2K resolution. And after you finish all the settings, you can choose to export 4K and 8K, okay? So, and also we have different ambient lights in here. Normally, I just recommend that you can choose the realistic one. So that's more realistic after the rendering. And I don't recommend you to open this automatic explosion because sometimes the explosion may be wrong. So you can change the brightness in here, like you can change the door indoor brightness, like get that number to 18 to 120. So in this range of the brightness, it will be no problem for the rendering. Okay. And also you can uh, choose with this different HDR pictures in here, right? And also we can upload it if you want, if you have a better HDI pictures. Okay. And on our right side, you can see there is a small navigator, which means you can uh, choose different rooms in here. Like you can choose the room, the living room, and also you can display with the whole room, right? So, and also in this uh, page, we have these camera settings in here. You can see the camera's properties like the height and also the angle for the camera so you can adjust in here and also we have foe which means the angle of the camera so you can choose from standard to human and also with a wide view for the whole space and also if you want to use the clipping you can see if i put my camera uh, in here and you can see my camera just blocked by the walls right if i use the clipping you can see I just can cut the view from outside and see the interior by using the clipping, okay? And also we have the smart angle. That's the angle that chosen by our system, right? You can find some good angle and also you can make some adjustment for these angles as you want, okay? And after you fin find a nice angle, right? And then it, after you adjust them and you can click Safe angle. So you will see the angle is in here with a small view. So, and also for our rendering, the most important part is our uh, composition, which means you need to set a camera with a better place, right? So, normally you can just drag this camera in this small navigator in here, and also you can press number one to go top view to have a better. Uh, view for the whole floor plan so and also you can right choose the clipping and also to save the angle right and go back to this angle by press number three you can see and number four you can see the different angle in here right so if you download this you can just uh, click generate and click render 
So before the rendering is finished, uh, I want to make a tips for you guys because for the composition, I hope you can consider as a photograph. Okay, so all the lines in these uh, pictures should be horizontal and vertical, which means this line should be in order and it will make this room with a much uh, order and beautiful composition okay so that's the skill for composition so after you finish you can make a quick view in here and also you can find in panorama so they normally they have the same uh page in in the right side and the left side right and one thing you need to be uh, consider is that for the panorama okay because our panorama will render for the whole circle of this camera so just make sure your camera is on the middle of the space and it will generate with us a 360 degree panorama so that's the and also for top view, you can see you can set the camera and also change the height and the different angles for it. So let's go back to the gallery to see, make a quick view. Sometimes you'll find it's, it's a little problem to open this page and you can go outside and get in again, okay? so. You can see it's not very good, but you can make a very quick rendering for these quick settings, right? So that's for the quick rendering. And we also have a small assignment for you guys. Okay, you can use the light template to quick render two images, one for the bedroom and one for the living room, okay?